Welcome back to our channel. My name is Darisha. My husband's name is Dario and this is our YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a video by myself and I'm going to be showing you guys Merit Beauty as you guys seen a little bit in the intro. So they were kind enough to send me a few pieces from their collection that's actually going to be available at Sephora and I'm going to be testing it out with you guys and doing my makeup and showing you guys a more simple um, subtle look would be really amazing for this and especially nowadays we're wearing masks and stuff like that so we do not want to have a bunch of thick caked up makeup so we're going to go ahead and get into the product i love that they sent this this is so pretty it's actually a little nice um makeup bag and i think this is just so nice and i feel like i would even use this as a really cute like clutch um for a date or whatnot it's just really cute minimalistic love the packaging um so this brand and i'll actually go ahead and start pulling it up so that way um i can actually give you guys a little bit more of the facts and their whole vibe is just a minimalist vibe i personally i do love a full coverage foundation but i notice most of my full coverage foundations are super lightweight i'm more into um, lightweight coverage that it actually covers and does a really good job and I actually get that full coverage if I do want that for like a date night kind of occasion what I picked out is the minimalist per perfecting complexion stick so I love that they're not calling this like a foundation stick or anything like that it's just a complexion stick something that is going to hide or blur out any imperfections that you might have um, and then I also picked out the lipstick this is a tinted lip oil so I currently live in Alaska here with my husband we're stationed here because he's in the army and I have had the worst dry lips. I've been using a lot of different lip balms and I'm loving them, but they haven't been fully hydrating my lips like completely for a long amount of time. So I'm super excited to try this out and also for it to be a tint, although we're not showing our lips right now, but it's still just good to have that color. The complexion stick is $38, which is amazing. I actually have the shade Sepia. So um, hopefully this is my right shade and we'll go into seeing if this fits me and if I have any problems with it. And then for the lip oil, um, oh, so I want to kind of give you guys a little bit of more information on the complexion stick. It says it's not a foundation or concealer, but it'll replace both in your makeup bag. So um, definitely a amazing product that I feel like just going off of this, the description, I would kind of gravitate towards more. So the tinted lip oil, a slick of sheer color infused with rose hip oil and shea butter for healthy lips all day. Um, and both of these have about 4.5 star reviews, 4.5 star reviews. So they're both really good. Also, Afterpay is available on their website. And this is the actual company's website, Merit, M-E-R-I-T, uh, MeritBeauty.com. And I got the shade Pink Beat. Um which is more of a pop of color. They even show a woman of color wearing it. So it's going to be a little bit more sheer, but it is going to show up. Um, again, I love that they are inviting um, a lot of women of color on their platform and showing um, other like different skin types or whatnot. And as far as the shade shade ranges for the complexion stick these are the shade ranges it is available at sephora so here is a list of their products that they have available get a little closer and as you guys can see it has that clean beauty clean at sephora tab um showing that it's clean go ahead and get into my makeup routine so this is just something that i do on a regular um you know before covid um during covid now i just typically do my brows and my forehead because there's no need to do a full face um, unless i'm taking pictures but I typically just do a more natural approach to makeup. 
I am starting out with an angle brush with the Anastasia Dip Brow in Ebony. This is an all-time favorite when I first started doing my brows. I had used this and my husband was like, why did you start off with like an expensive product when you're trying to learn how to do your brows? Because I do not have any brows. And um, I, I just noticed I end up having a new shape every day. And this was kind of expensive, but I noticed it lasts me like the full 12 months. It is something that you only need a little bit of, and it definitely makes a difference. I'm going to go in. I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills. I think this is the number 18 or 20, but it has the flat in, and then it has the spoolie in on the other side. I'm going to go in with that brush. And I'm going to use the Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define Concealer. And I'm using shade 13.2. So I just kind of line under and just define my brows. I'm gonna go ahead and go into my lashes and I hardly ever curl my lashes but for the sake of this video I am going to curl it today um, and I'm pretty sure it's gonna give me a better lash look um, and this is Cleanology it's just one of those that I've kept for years and I got it from TJ Maxx um, or Marshalls and I'm going in with the L'Oreal Voluminous Primer on my lashes to prime my lashes okay so since this is a more natural makeup look I am going in with just mascara and I'm using the Rimmel London Scandal Eyes Mascara <laughs> gonna go ahead and open this up and like I said I was in the shade sepia or that's the shade that I chose and this is actually my first time opening up the packaging it looks so pretty and minimalistic and like they said it is something that I would definitely want to keep on um, my vanity so this is just the first wipe of it and it looks like it blends in super well I'm going to use a foundation brush so you guys can see on here. It literally looks like I have nothing on. I am obsessed. This is my first time actually using some kind of complexion stick. So I'm just going to put it on. Oh my gosh, you guys. Like, I want to go out and buy like 10 of these now. Like... It is so smooth onto my skin. Like, oh my God. Okay, let's blend this first batch out. You guys, it blends in so freaking well. Oh, I'm like so surprised. It's literally like I have nothing on. They did so well with this, you guys. I am so shocked. This is game changing. Like, I, I don't even need to put anything else on. Like that, like just like the cat lines or whiskers. This up here, a little on my nose and some on my chin. I might just go ahead and put a little bit to like blend down my neck. Just like a few lines. But. Oh my God. Like, full disclosure, this was definitely sent to me, but. I'm obsessed like this is one of those products I'm going to repurchase 
like it's so good and the shade matches perfectly i actually want to go and get like a lighter shade to actually do like under my eyes and highlight because i feel like it would work so well and blend in so well like i am so like just putting it on it was immediately so smooth and it like literally felt like somebody was massaging my face this is one of those products that i truly believe that they did take the time to actually go through and make sure that they don't have any bad chemicals or things that would make someone's skin react badly because it feels so natural um and it literally just makes me change my mind about like the beauty that i'm carrying in my collection because this is like so good um so next we're gonna go ahead and go into um using what is it our blush so i am right now using the glossier um i don't think yeah i don't think i have it upside down but this is the glossier um cloud paint in haze so now that we're done with our blush i am going ahead and going into the highlight so this is the revlon highlighter that i've been loving lately that i've been using um, it is in the shade 201 Daybreak Glimmer, and I think this was actually sent to me as well, um, and I genuinely love it, and it's a really good brand, um, and it's drugstore, so you can find it anywhere, and it's reasonably priced. Okay, so um, after that, I have started using um, a, what is it called? A contour. I started to use a contour, and this came out by makeup revolution it is um revolution glow it is a matte bronzer and i'm in the shade dark and i'll show you guys how this shade looks um so yeah i really love this product and i'm using it with this um uh, makeup revolution um 403 brush i think this came in a set that i found on um found at marshall's you have some lip balm on so i do want to wipe this off so i can get the full effect of this um tinted lip oil so i'm going to wipe that off so my lips are a little dry now and i'm just gonna apply this lip liner and oh my god the packaging you guys it's so pretty um okay let me face it towards there it is so freaking gorgeous it's really pretty this is definitely something i would want on my vanity um in the applicator i love that it's small um and it's not too big to where it's pulling out a lot of product so oh my god it's so lightweight like it feels like i'm putting water on my lips like it it just moves out so easily and it definitely picks up color and it's more of a natural color um oh my god you guys it's it's so nice oh my god it's so nice and i'll do a few up close so you guys can see pretty much it um i would even feel comfortable wearing this foundation underneath a mask um and it's not thick to where i feel like it won't um have too much like residue onto the mask and i love this um this looks so good with um the lip liner but even without it it would probably look so nice and i love that it actually picks up color because that's always my issue with like tinted lip balms or tinted lip oils is that it doesn't show and if it does show it's too bright but this is really natural on my skin 
and I love how it looks. It's so pretty and yeah, it's just super natural. I'm super happy with how it turned out. This is a really nice natural look, easy for Valentine's Day, date night, date day, just depending on your vibe and um, what you wanna do with your makeup, how you like your makeup. I definitely recommend this for anybody, um, uh, teens to young adults to even people um, older, like I think it'll just, it's a really nice option to have, especially once we're going into the hotter months. Like we do not want to have, well I personally do not want to have any cakiness, anything that's like I'm sweating and it's falling off onto my clothes. This is definitely a really good option to have and I'm so glad that they reached out. Thank you so much Merit Beauty. I honestly cannot wait to see where this brand takes off and I am super excited to go ahead and dive into more of their other products. And I personally definitely would purchase these products over and over again. I know this was sent to me, but I can definitely see myself after using this going ahead and clicking add to cart because these products are just so well made and well designed and well thought about. And I tell you like, it. I know you can't try on like, you know, you can't use it right now at the store, but I'm telling you, it's honestly amazing and I wanted to try this out. They didn't even ask me to do a YouTube video. Um, it was just gonna, going to be like a feed post for Instagram, which I'm going to go ahead and take. And maybe a little bit of this footage is going to be probably for Instagram reel. But I did definitely want to do this YouTube video to try out this product and just see how I liked it and just to show you guys genuinely my first impressions. So I'm so glad I tried it and was able to share with you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching and taking the time out to watch another one of our videos. Please like, comment, anything that you guys want to see next and I will see you guys in our next video. I think this look is perfect for work, for um, an easy date day night. Easy date night, easy date, easy day date. Why was that so hard for me to figure out? <laughs>